Listen, Harikata. Hari Kata is the biggest fire sacrifice. Hari Kata is the best fire sacrifice. Sit down, everybody. Sit down, everybody. Half an hour, I'll speak. Hari Kata, then half an hour. Half an hour. Fire sacrifice, and then. Kitna Kalpa, 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 I would like to offer obeisances to my Guru Pad Padmani Tila Prashto Shri Pad Ashtatra Sachi Shimad Bhakti Vedanta Prabhamana Goswami Maharaj Krishna Mohan Shri Pad Ashtatra Sachi Shimadanta Prabhamana Goswami Maharaj In their lotus feet I offer my Danvat Pranams Dhanu Nitya Lila Prabhishtha Mohan Shri Pad Ashtutra Sachi Shemad Bhakti Vedanta Swami Maharaj Sankar Guru Nusha Maharaj Bhakti Raksha Sri Dhar Goswami Maharaj Puri Goswami Maharaj To all the Vaishnava Vaishnavis I offer My infinite Dhanvat Pranams Transmitter is working Hari Bol It's a very sweet thing that today we are here in the shelter of the lotus feet of Srila Gurudev and the picture of Gurudev is also very nice I, when I entered the house I was looking if, is it the is it the deities or the picture like you can see it's very nice picture it looks like it's a deity but it's a picture what is the name of the temple here? Ananda Krishna Das. Anil Krishna Das is the name of the Prabhu Jesus, the organizer of the house program. And her wife, his wife name, what is the name? Mahalakshmi. Mahalakshmi ki jai. See all Mahalakshmi is from the, around the world are here. What are you doing? Sit down. Fire sacred, biggest fire sacrifice is Harikata, like chanting holy names. Listen Harikata. Turn off the stoves, come out from kitchen and listen Harikata. Sit everybody. Harikata is Girtan. Everybody sit down. When we will do fire sacrifice, the smoke will come and you all run away from here. For this regard, I thought before sacrifice, sacrifice, let's do Harikata. We need a proper place to sit, listen Harikata or not? Right now we are sitting inside, later we will sit outside when uh, because there will be so much smoke around of fire sacrifice. Listen Harikata. So what was I telling about? It's, it's the month of Kartik. The name of Kartik month is also. Do you know? This month is called Urja Vrat. Niyam Seva Maas. Urja Vrat. It's not uh, like you are very very fortunate, extremely fortunate that you are here in Vraj right now. When the fortune from many many lives is yet collected, then you sit in Sadhu and you listen Katha because no one wants to listen Katha. I will speak very less, no problem. Don't disturb me also. And when the many many times of many many lives of Sukriti gets collected and accumulated, then you get the fortune to get Sadhu Sang. And that too in the month of Kartik, see from all people from all around the world, all the high class saints, all the high class people doing bhajan from all around the world are here. Big, give a big round of applause for everybody. Is this true or not? What more can I say? Mahalakshmi is also there. Who is Mahalakshmi? Sarva Lakshmi, Srimati Radhika. That is Mahalakshmi. Who is Mahalakshmi? Srimati Radhika. Wherever she appears, there is Mahalakshmi. So there are all, all kind of unlimited opulences manifest with Srimati Radhika simultaneously in the month of Kartik, especially. This is called Niyam Seva Maas. This is called Urja Vrata also. In this month, people for one month, they observe a fast. Like people do fast for demigodess. How many days? Nine days in Navaratri in India. They observe the Hanumanji. How many days do you follow fast? 
कितने दिन रखते हर मंगलवार मंगलवार को द्वादशी बट परम गुरु महाराज बिकॉज ऑफ डिसअपियरेंस डे वी स्टार्ट द कार्तिक मंथ ऑन द पूर्णिमा ऑन शरद पूर्णिमा वी स्टार्ट इट बिकॉज ऑफ द डिसअपियरेंस डे ऑफ आर परम गुरु देवा एंड देन वी एंड इट ऑन पूर्णिमा विच इज in ras purnima we end the end this ya bhi sarat purnima shuru ho gaya sarat purnima also started the like autumn winter season is coming and then the next purnima will come next full moon night will come hemant kal it's called hemant kal iske baad purnima ke baad after purnima gopis what will they do do you remember do you know patraini vrat गौरी वैष्णव डोंट ऑब्जर्व कत्यानी फास्ट बिकॉज वी टू वी कैप फास्ट ऑलरेडी फॉर श्रीमती राधिका नो नीड टू गिव फास्ट फॉर कत्यानी एज योर बॉडी अलाउज यू कैन फॉलो फास्ट एज मच एज यू वॉन्ट बट इफ यू गिव ट्रेवल टू योर बॉडी डोंट अटेन गॉड It does not mean if you give trouble to your body, you will attain God. Austerities. Austerity. Tapasya means giving trouble to body. If you don't do Hari Bhajan and you do many many renunciation, many many austerities, not eating, not drinking anything. For this part in scriptures, it is coming. You should eat nice, eat, eat pure things, eat what is needed, but should not overeat. Should eat appropriately. Then you can do bhajan. Because in Kali Yuga, whatever you say, Kali Yuga. What is the main goal? Hari Doshana means. But how can we please Shri Hari? This is the subject of our. We don't do Hari Bhajan and we don't please Hari, and we do many many other things. We do fire sacrifice. We do many many donations, and you went to many many holy places. You took bath in many many rivers. You studied many many Vedas, but no benefit at all. That's why scriptures are coming. What should you do? Chant holy names. Why? Because in Kali Yuga, chanting holy names, Nama Dhara. This is our only hope. Nama Dhara. In this Kali Yuga, no need to do anything else. Only take shelter of chanting holy names. Hari Nam, Hari Nam, Hari Nam is the only way. In this Kali Yuga, no need to do anything else. People won't be able to do that also because doing this is also very hard. Do or not? If you do do fire sacrifice, then how possible can you do it properly? First, you won't be able to find a Brahman. If you find a Brahman, then you won't get the materials needed. If you get materials needed, also then you won't get the you won't get the pure ghee. You won't get the purity in the items. If you get even get a pure ghee, you won't get pure wood. In reality, to do fire sacrifice, you need five types of wood. You need five type of woods in one fire sacrifice. But today, I have where to find? Okay, whatever you find, you can do no problem. That's why it is coming in scriptures. So in different different ages in time different different processes were more prominent. In Treta in Satya Yoga, what did people used to do? What process were prominent? There was meditation. They were focusing their mind. They had to Vishnu, meditating on one Vishnu. 
But in Kali Yoga, it's not possible to meditate. Very, very hard. It's very, very hard. You just close your eyes and you will fall, you will fall asleep. You want to sleep. You will feel like sleeping. If you be able to meditate properly, so you won't be able to meditate properly. If you close your eyes and sit and think about Govinda and many, many other thoughts, other worries will strike your mind. True or not? So very hard to meditate. Dhyan means like uh, like completely absorbing your mind and heart towards your goal and thinking about it. This is called dhyan, like proper meditation. This but in Kali Yoga, not possible. Treta, in Treta Yoga, they used to do, what did they do in Treta Yoga? In the, they used to do fire sacrifices. But in Kali Yoga, not possible to do fire sacrifice properly. We will forget, they like there will be, must be a fault in Kali Yoga if you do fire sacrifice. Like, for example, you cannot get all the materials needed because you cannot find in the markets how to find. You, if you find betel nut, then you can't find supari. Like, one or one or the other thing gets missing. So in Kali Yoga, not possible to do fire sacrifice. In Dwapar Yoga, in Dwapar Yoga, what did people used to do? What was more prominent process? Archan. In, in Kali Yoga, you cannot do Archan properly also. Can you do Archan perfectly? There are many, many rules and regulations to do Archan. That's why it is coming. The fruits of Satya Yoga, meditation, in, and the fruits of Treta Yoga, fire sacrifice, and the fruits of the archan of proper yoga, you will get all of these only and only by simply by chanting holy names. You will get all these fruits very easily. And it's very easy. In Kali Yoga, the age of Kali chanting holy names is very easy. No rules and regulation. Eating, sleeping, walking. Any time you can chant holy names. No any rules and regulations. You chant at day, morning, afternoon, night, midnight, any time. Any time it suits you. No rule is there. Just chant holy names. For this regard, in Kali Yoga, the best thing is to chant holy names. And you can attain everything. Not chanting holy names will everything you want. But yet, people don't have unconscious faith that everything will work out if I just chant holy names. They don't have this faith. They don't have the condensed faith. And if you don't do, then you also not feel good. That's why chanting, because you're like, oh, we brought many, many things to do fire sacrifice, for example. And Maharajji, Gurudev did not do fire sacrifice and he went away. Will you like it or not? From outside, you'll say, oh, Gurudev, okay. Whatever you want, you do, Gurudev. From outside, you will say this. I was just thinking that today, let's do Kirtan, do Harikata and not do fire sacrifice. I was thinking this. No need for fire sacrifice. But from outside, I know they will say, outside they will say, okay, but from inside they will feel bitter. They won't feel, they won't like it from the inside. Whatever they say from outside. Because they're all, this is conditioned soul problem also. So I think, okay, let's do some fire sacrifice. They say, swaha, swaha. And you all will say, aha, aha. No problem. I will say, swaha. And you will say, speak it out loud. Aha. So anyhow, God, you should pray to please God. Whether you say Aha or Swaha, God accepts your mood. God accepts your mood. Bhava Grahi Janardana. In Kali Yoga, the, what is the age? In Satya Yoga, the humans used to live for how many years? 100,000 years. The average life was 100,000. 100,000. 100,000. 100,000 years. And then in, in, in the next yuga, it was one zero less. It became 10,000. In Treta Yoga, Satya Yoga, in Treta Yoga, one zero, remove one zero, now it becomes 10,000 years. That was the average life expectancy of humans. And next yoga, in Dwapar Yoga, one more zero less. Now how many? 1,000 years. In Kali Yoga, 
वन मोर जीरो लेस सो हंड्रेड इयर्स एंड दैट इवन इज वेरी हार्ड लाइक हू लिव फॉर हंड्रेड इयर्स वेरी वेरी फ्यू पीपल लिव टू द एज ऑफ हंड्रेड इन वन विलेज इट्स वेरी वेरी रेयर टू फाइंड पर्सन हु इज लाइक अराउंड इवन मोर देन नाइन्टी फाइव स्ट्रोक कैन कम एनी टाइम हार्ट अटैक कैन कम एनी टाइम यू नो डोंट नो एंड देन विल बी जेस हियर आई मीन यू विल डाई because body will grow old that's why god is saying when kali yoga i am giving concessions to the to its max just chant holy name no need to do anything do and today tomorrow anything just chant holy name that's why kali yoga no need to do anything at all just chant holy name hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare कलयुग भजन और श्री हरि डू हरि भजन नो नीड टू डू एनीथिंग एल्स वन डिसाइबल सेट टू गुरु गुरु जी यू टेल मी टेल मी प्रॉपरली कलयुग वॉट इज द बेस्ट थिंग टू डू गुरुदेव सेट लोक इन कलयुग यू शुड डू भजन नॉट भोजन विच मीन्स टू ईटिंग फूड ईट फूड यू आर ईटिंग फूड डेली नो प्रॉब्लम बट वॉट शुड डू इन कलयुग Hari Bhajan means worship the Hari. Guru, the disciple said, Guru Dev, when shall I do it? When shall I do Bhajan? Guru Dev said, Look, when your death will come, at the just before death, chant holy names. At the time of death, chant holy names. Ajamil, what did he do? At the time of death, he chanted the name. The disciple said, Guru Dev, tell me. When will my death come? I don't know. So what should I do? Then what to do? Guru Dev say, "To stand now. You might die next second. There is no surety. You can die next second. So chant holy names right now, right away. So in Kali Yuga, chanting holy names is the most prominent process. Just start right now. especially in the month of kartik this is urja vrat this is the very very auspicious month is mahine mein mas mein in this month jo kuch bhi karo whatever you do aapke itna phal prapti you will get multiplied fruits of that day you will get anything you want because in this month all the sabse badi madhur lila hai All the sweet pastimes of Krishna manifested in this month. In other other months, there were different different pastimes. But look, in this Kartik month, they did the, the biggest pastime of Krishna. Which one? I told you before. In this month, Mother Yashoda she tied Krishna to a motor with a rope. इन दाम बंधन लीला इट इज कमिंग दिस मंथ श्रीमती राधिका श्री टाइट कृष्ण श्रीमती राधिका ऑल्सो टाइट कृष्ण सो टू मेन प्रोमिनेंट लीला जाते हैं इन दिस मंथ वन इज यशोदा दामोदर एंड वन इज राधा दामोदर व्हिच इज द बेस्ट यू टेल मी राधा दामोदर दिस यू ऑल आर वेरी स्कॉलर्स यू ऑल आर वेरी वेरी स्ट्रांग वेरी नाइस You want to see the shelter of Radha Damodar. Just Radha Damodar ki bhi katha. Just Radha Damodar katha is also nice. But Radha Damodar is very high class katha. For this regard, Guru Dev used to, Guru Pad Padma used to say, till how the the qualification can reach till where? Chanta Dasya Sakya Vatsal. Till the Vatsal yet can reach. द कथा ऑफ माधुर्य द श्रृंगार रस कथा इट्स नॉट ओके टू स्पीक अबाउट इट एवरी वे बिकॉज पीपल विल मिस इंटरप्रेट इट देर मटीरियल कंसेप्शन विल कम मटीरियल कंसेप्शन विल कम इट विल कम और नॉट बट इस रिगार्ड दासा सक्का वाद सल टिल दैट मूड यू कैन स्पीक बट द द माधुर्य कथा दिस मूड इज वेरी वेरी कॉन्फिडेंशियल If you don't do bhajan and don't chant holy names properly, and you listen Madhurya Ras Katha, then your mind will be mind it might become disturbed, and doubts might come in your heart. That's why scriptures say.
So whatever you do, those who have past life impressions, they just like jump across the whole process. Like some person was about to die, for example. He could not even digest water. The doctor said what to do. Give him ghee. Give him ghee. If he is not able to drink water, then how possible he will, will he digest ghee? He look, he is about to die. What's the problem? You can give anything. If anyone is to die, they will die. So do one thing. Give him some ghee. At least the ghee will go there inside his stomach. He will go inside and maybe he gets some power in his body and may, might we be protected. What is the meaning? The humans of Kali Yuga, they are contaminated by anger, lust, many many things like this. Whatever Katha I say, I say Radhe Radhe many many times and after some times people say Lade Lade. Like give me, give me, give me, give me this, give me that. I say Radhe Radhe. But after some time people they say Lade, give me this, give me this. What else? I'm not saying this for everybody, but I'm just saying a general. I'm just saying generally. Disregarding Kali Yuga, what should you do? Chant holy names. See, they made a very beautiful fire sacrifice kunda. Do you, do you want this or not? For example, if you do fire sacrifice, what do you want? Little Havan Kunda, where you can put the wood and you can perform fire sacrifice. This Nam Sankirtan is also called fire sacrifice. So this, our mouth is the Havan Kunda. This mouth is like Havan Kunda. And ghee is? In Havan what should you offer? You should put ghee. So Nam Sankirtan, this is the ghee. And then you need a spoon also. Spoon to collect the ghee and offer it in the fire sacrifice. So this tongue is the spoon. And now you offer it. We put word in it. Chant holy names. And this is proper fire sacrifice. Krishna, Krishna, Hare, 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 Ramu, Hare, Ramu, 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 Hare, Hare. Okay, Namsa. Is it going to be doing? Namsa. Can you give Namsa and Girtan? Can you give Namsa? This is called Namsa and Girtan Yagya, fire sacrifice of Namsa and Girtan. Rari, Jalati, Sumedha. 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 Krishna Vartam Isatishna Sandhu Bhangatra Parshadam Chakri Sankirtana Prari Dadanti Sumedha 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 A very very intelligent person Who is the most intelligent person Most knowledgeable The one who accepts the shelter of holy names That person is the most knowledgeable in this material world, people think person wants money, who is intelligent, people who think those, who remember many many shlokas, they are knowledgeable, those who study get many many degrees, those who get many many degrees, people they think they are intelligent. They say knowledgeable person. Their mind is sharp, they say. But our scriptures, they say they are the most foolish. In scriptures it is coming. This is the surprising thing. In this world, the one who we think is intelligent in transcendental perspective, that vision, it is a foolish person. Because those who are not doing worship, worshipping Sri Hari, those who are doing Hari Bhajan, they are foolish. Understand? You should do Hari Bhajan. Why? Because this human body is very rare to get. God, by His mercy, gave us the body of this human being. Why? So that we could do Hari Bhajan. Nothing else. If we don't do Hari Bhajan, and just earn money, made some Jan Kaman, like making many, many friends, making nice social status, and maintaining family. This is nothing. What you need to do in this material world, you will have to leave everything in this material world. You will have to go alone from here. Chant holy names. Chant the name of Shri Hari. Oh, someone, please. 
Our beloved Our Ram Chandra, I'm sh- sh- shouting across all the streets. I'm throwing away the jewels of the name of Sri Ram. Clap your hands. Very beautiful. Tulsi well, Dasji says, "People in this material world, they are all scholars, or are they foolish?" If you drink milk, your body is nourished. Body gets the nutrients. But if the person who is bringing the milk, the person who is selling the milk, what they do? They go to house, house, house. To every house, they go to deliver the milk. And sometimes they pay the money. They delay the payments of the milk seller. They they carry so heavy weight to every house for one month. Give you milk. And at the time of giving money, what do you say? Well, oh, we have not received, we don't have money, we will, salary has not come. We will pay you next month all together, no problem. Wait for two, four, two days, four days. And then you say, oh, our, our payment is stuck. My payment I received, but my wife didn't receive her payment, so I can't pay your bill. So we say like this or not. And I got salary, my wife got salary, but my children, my son's salary did not come. So you please wait for two more days. The milk, milk seller has to go to every each house to give the milk. If you drink the milk, the body is nourished. The alcohol, alcohol it destroys the body. Everything in the body is destroyed by alcohol. It causes many many diseases. People who drink alcohol, they are nicer. What? See? That alcohol, <coughs> to buy alcohol, they have to go to shop. They stand in big, big queues to purchase alcohol. No need to for queues to collect milk, to, to get milk, to get alcohol. In the shop of uh, alcohol, there is so huge queues. You have to stand in queues and then purchase and you pay directly in cash. You delay the payment of the milk, but you buy all the alcohol on cash straight away. People, they use credit cards, the debit cards these days. The technology demands. But anyways, my subject is this. The people of this material world, how they are? Foolish. They have many, many degrees. They have many, many material knowledge. That's why they said, the knowledge of this material world, it makes a person foolish material knowledge is the quality of maya it makes a human a donkey it makes human a donkey like then they're working day and night like a donkey for this regard i'm saying the scriptures it is coming who is scholar? Who is a pandit? One who is doing Hari Bhajan. That is the person who is most intelligent. But people of the material world, they will abuse. They will use bad words. Because they won't understand. But in scriptures it is coming. You got this prayer body of a human being. And if you waste, don't waste this life by just eating and sleeping. What will you get? Nothing. You came with your fist closed and you will go and your hands will be open. You will take nothing. This body will be burnt and everyone will talk around the streets. Oh beloved of Ram, I am shouting all across the streets. Please take the name of Sri Ram. See, very beautiful Kirtan is this in Hindi. In the near life, you should do bhajan of God. Nothing else you need to do. At least chant holy names. See Ajami, what did he name his child? Narayan. And, uh, 
in time of his death he chanted this name calling his child in the nama bas manifested and then in that a jamil attained by kuntha he attained by kuntha is we come se kam for this regard everyone should at least chant holy names jab tak hum hari naam nahi kare we don't chant holy names our heart will not be purified especially in this i'm telling you about the kartik month is kartik mein hai in this month you should try to chant more rounds you should try to chant two or four more more rounds extra in this month kam hone nahi chahiye it should not be less it should be more is the kartik mein But this is Kartik month. All the most and most beautiful amorous pastime of Krishna manifested in this month. The Sharadiya Ras, the Ras Lila happened during the Sharadiya Purnima. In this month, Ras Lila happened during the Krishna. Think about this. Krishna did cow herding during this month. He went for cow herding with his friends. In the same month, Krishna, he lifted up Giriraj Govardhan. Indra was causing chaos in the Govardhan, and to punish Indra, he lifted up a very, very huge mountain on his pinky finger of his left hand. He picked up a huge mountain to teach Indra a lesson. In the same month. What other pastime? Lila. Today is the I mean, appearance of Radha Kund. Bahula Ashtami is coming. Check the calendar. Very beautiful. This month is so auspicious. Mother Yashoda she tied Krishna. So Radha tied Krishna also. And Diwali, Diwali one of the major festivals of India is also in this month. The Brajwasis. Very beautifully they light up the ghee wax lamps and they decorate their houses. Diwali, Diwali is there. What else is there in this month? Vijay Gopashtami was there there also Many many past times of Krishna manifest in this month and all the acharyas they appeared during this month Kartik mahine mein abhirbhav hua appearance and disappearance days of the acharyas in this month ye bole abhi aaye aaj kya hai today is bahula ashtami bahula ashtami is ashtami tithi very very nice day it is People today they take bath in Radha Kund at 12 o'clock at midnight. They is the manifesting like appearance lila of Radha Kund. How Radha Kund appears? This lila is coming very beautiful past time. This is. Kadadar Das. And the Gadadhar Das and is the appearance day also is disappearance day of Gadadhar Das. The Radha Rani is rising day is Gadadhar 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 Pandit Gadadhar Pandit and his manifestation and the manifest Gadadhar Das in Chaitanya Charitamrita whatever is coming it is coming like this. One is Gadadhar Das and one is Gadadhar Pandit. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, he said him Pandit and he used to call him Gadadhar Pandit, Pandit Ji. But Gadadhar Pandit was very very expert in all Tattva Siddhanta. It was like direct, almost almost direct manifestation of Shri Gadadhar, Gadadhar Pandit. And that Sri Gadadhar Pandit's manifestation was Gadadhar Das. So it's very very auspicious month. Many many high class exalted personalities appeared and disappeared in this month. Recently we celebrated the Narottam Das Thakur's disappearance day. And so my point is in this month of Kartik, there are beautiful pastimes of Krishna that manifested in this month. We offer the deep dan, like offer the ghee with lamp in your house. You can do also.
in the sky you should like to offer the lamp the demigods they become happy in the heaven have you or like offer it to the sky and then to flow it in yamuna this is coming in scriptures also especially ananta krishna prabhu and his wife mahalakshmi mahalakshmi very beautiful is the name mahalakshmi all money comes because my lakshmi is the like presiding deities of wealth like goddess of demi goddess of wealth so in the like the sethani of braj mahalakshmi means shrimati radhika if you think krishna is a businessman then then uh, radharani is the like wife of the businessman because businessman earns money and give all his money to his wife sethani because set businessman he earns the money and after earning money he hands over all the money to sethani his wife and sethani she keeps all the money in her locker and she keeps the keys with her if you need any 1 rupee you need 1 rupee then you have to go to the wife of the businessman sethani so all the sethani ko hai sethani is in the brother uh, who the sethani of the braj shrimati radhika jai jai shri jai If Radharani is pleased, automatically the money will come in your house. Understanding my point? Do you want money or not? Anil ji, do you want money or not? At least say yes. Why are you saying no? Why are you saying you want or not? Why are you feeling shame? The devotee is saying no, I don't want. Guru is saying why are you feeling ashamed? You want money? Without money, how will your grace fire sacrifice? How will you feed many many Vaishnavas that are here without money? You would need to buy rice or wheat or not? So without money, anything does not. Like you will not work, will it? This is true. Once upon a time, Lord Krishna, he said to Yudhishthir Maharaj, Yudhishthir, listen. I give you benediction. Then, what do you want? I'll give you everything, anything you want. I'll give. Yudhishthir said. Yudhishthir Maharaj said. Prabhu, I don't want anything. You don't want anything. At least ask for something. Do I want to give you? Said, no, no, Prabhu, I don't want anything. Everything of this material world is painful. It's painful or not? If, if someone has money, he is also upset, and one who don't have money, he is also upset. Is this fact or not? If you don't have money, then how will you buy things? You will have to be hungry also, na? You will need to buy roti, ghee, or not? We need to purchase it. We need to purchase rice. Now no one will give you for free. Anyone, Prabhu, Anyone, Prabhu, is true or not? When anyone give you for free, no one will give you for free. But it's this predestined. It is predestined. So buy one, get one. Free. Buy one, get one, free one. In English, they 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 write in Western countries. They say buy one, buy one. Or eight free. And get or one eight. free. Eight. Just pay for one. one. So they say buy one get one free. Get one or free one. So long as free one, okay. I just want the free. No, you just have to buy first and then you get the free one. First, purchase something. Then you get the free that is coming along with it. But in reality, they charge you double money for that one thing. they are just Website, tricking your mind marketing market. this is just a marketing strategy this is just like a marketing yes. strategy you say buy one get one free buy one get one or free one that point ke hum what is the meaning i'm saying this because ha yudhishthir maharaj yudhishthir maharaj said i don't want anything bhagwan krishna hasne krishna started to laugh bhagwan krishna ke hasne aastre dekhenge After seeing him laugh, Yudhishthir Maharaj again he came. He did pranam to Krishna and said, "Prabhu ji, give me everything. I want everything." You just said you don't want anything. Krishna said, "He said, no, no, no. I want everything now. What do you want? Want everything? What do you want? Tell me. Name some things. What do you want? You tell me. First, you want wife. You want wife or not? Then." You want money? 
clothes, everything you need. God said, first you said you don't want anything, now you are saying you want everything, why? What will you do? That time Yudhishthir Maharaj gave a very beautiful answer. What did he say? I will put everything in the service of God. I will invest everything in the service of God. In this world, everything belongs to God. So put everything in the service of God. What's wrong with this? You understand my point? Like you're walking on the way and if you see a 500 rupee note on the ground, will you pick it up or not? Who will pick it up? Put up your hands. Who will pick up that 500 rupee note from the ground? So Devi is thinking I should not pick it up. <laughs> she's Sitani. She's like wife of a rich person. She will not pick up. The, uh, Prabhuji is saying I will grab it as soon as possible. <laughs> Why? Because you pick it up and put it in save of God. What's the problem? Everything, everything you see. Whatever you get, put in save of God. Whatever God gives you, put, him, put it, that thing in the seva. Like with Ganga Jal, you worship the river Ganga. In the same way, whatever God is giving you, money, money, birth, body, wife, everything, children, everything put in service of God. God give you money. You can give, put money where? Where to invest the money? So invest it in the service of God. We can construct a beautiful temple, make a beautiful bell. In the temple, there will be a nice bell. There are glories of bells. The sound of bell, the sound of that, like the sound vibrations, it repels all the ghost and inauspiciousness. In, the, in your house, you should have a bell, like a temple bell. Do you have a temple bell here? No. Make Put a temple bell in the house. Before you enter the house, you should put like a bell that's in the temple. Because house is temple or not? That's, the house is a temple. Think your house is a temple. And this is for the service of God. This is for the service of Thakurji. You need a bell also. Like you go to temple, first you play a big bell and then you go inside. In every temple you can see. Before you enter the temple, you have to ring the bell. Like ring the bell. It's very very important also. When you ring it, the sound as it spreads, for that lifetimes, you won't be able like to, you won't come back to this material world. So they are the glories of the like, bell. House, you should have this bell that you see in the temple. At least blow conch shell. Do you have conch shell in the house or not? Do you know how to play it? You don't know. Try. You will learn quickly. That's why I am saying in this Kartik month, Many things we see, many things I told about the month of Kartik. We'll do fat sacrifice here also. We'll say so and we'll, we'll, we'll spoke and read one shok of Gita. Dharma Shetra Kurukshetra. Mamuka in the month of Karthik, read the shloka of Bhagavatam. Shloka Bhagavat. Any shloka you can read you want, you like, you can read huge shlokas. In this month, Gita, Bhagavat, Ramayana, anything you study you want. The glories are so much if you study in this month. For this regard, you should read scriptures in this month. The smoke will spread of fire sacrifice, it repels all the ghosts and insociousness, it runs away with the smoke of fire sacrifice. If there is no smoke of fire sacrifice, then how will the ghost run away? So what should you do? 
the smoke is important in the wire sacrifice like for example when radha rani cooks when she's cooking ye dekho krishna chintan she thought about krishna suddenly and she started to cry simultaneously and jatila came in the kitchen when jatila came and what did radha ji do she she put some water in the in the, in the in the wood like the wood that was burning the wood was wet now in the meantime jatila came and said why are you crying why are you crying why are there tears in your eyes radha rani said no 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 i am not crying how possible there are tears in your eyes why are you rubbing your eyes why are you crying like radha ji she said she said so today the wood was a bit wet that's why the smoke is coming when i am trying to cook through this when 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 krishna she thinks about krishna shrimati radha rani spontaneously she starts to cry Vaishnava poets, Vaishnava poets, Vaishnava poets Vaishnava 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 they have explained very very beautifully like Narottam Das Thakur among all the Vaishnavas during the time of Mahaprabhu there are three time periods I too said many many times but people they understand and sometimes not understand how many are there what did I tell you Like Mahaprabhu's age, there are three yugas, three time periods. One is Prak Chaitanya Yug. Prak Chaitanya Yug, meaning the time period before the appearance of Mahaprabhu. That is called Prak Chaitanya Yug. And then Chaitanya Yug, that, that the time period where Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was present. And the third one. चैतन्य प्रवृत्ति योग मीनिंग द टाइम पीरियड आफ्टर देन महाप्रभु केम आफ्टर ऑल द वैष्णव दैट केम आफ्टर महाप्रभु एंड ऑल दे एक्सप्लेन मेनी मेनी थिंग्स अबाउट राधा एंड कृष्ण दैट इज कॉल्ड चैतन्य प्रवृत्ति चैतन्य प्रवर्तक योग श्रीवासम दास ठाकुर नरोत्तम श्रीनिवास दे ऑल चैतन्य महाप्रभु बट दे डिड नॉट चुक दर्शन ऑफ महाप्रभु बट दे रोड मनी मनी नाइस स्ट्रक्चर बाबा जी महाराज सेड इफ यू वॉन्ट ब्रज प्रेम इफ यू वॉन्ट प्रेम ऑफ व्रज ओनली जस्ट स्पेंड फाइव रुपीज जस्ट फाइव रुपीज यू नीड वॉट टू डू विद दैट फाइव रुपीज गो टू द मार्केट एंड परचेज अ स्मॉल बॉक What what is the price of that book? Five rupees. Just purchase that book and keep it in your house and see you in the bus directly. So which book? Prem Bhakti Chandrika. Prem Bhakti Chandrika. Not the Tundas Kapoor. All the Vedic Puran, Upanishad. And Gita, Bhagavad Gita, Gita, Bhagavad Ramayan. Gita, Bhagavad Ramayan. All are they manifested in that book? Read that book. Even Ujjwal, even Ujjwal, Nain, Manin, all, all the essences in that book. Prem Bhakti Chandrika. Prem Bhakti Chandrika is the name of the book. Very nice book it is. You have to read that book. You need to read the books or not? It's important. For this regard, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu said, you should read scriptures. Get some knowledge that why are we observing fast in this month? Why are we doing Kartik Brat? Why are we doing the observing this month? Why are we observing the fast in this month? So only our desire is to please Shri Mati Radhika. May she be pleased with us. Because the presiding duties of this month is Shri Mati Radhika. If you observe fast for Shri Mati Radhika, meaning a worth fast of Kartik, then Shri Mati Radhika is pleased. For this regard, we we observe the fast. Radha Rani is pleased, and if she is pleased with us, then automatically Krishna will be pleased. If you chant the name of Radha Krishna, will please. And if you just chant the name of Krishna, then Radha Rani is pleased. The scriptures are coming. 
राधा नाम द नेम ऑफ श्री राधा इज द मोस्ट बेस्टाउजेंड नेम्स ऑफ विष्णु we get the fruits of chanting the name of one ram name of ram and if you chant no, and if you chant the name of ram three times that is equal to the fruits of chanting the name of krishna one time so oh, did i say teen ram ram naam karne par chanting the name of ram three times you get the fruits of chanting of krishna one time and when you chant the name of krishna sort 100 times that is equal to one name of shrimati radhika so what should you chant what is the smart thing to do just chant the name of shri radha radhe 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 radha naam hai aur radha naam aur krishna in the name of radha and krishna to join both of them together and drink the nectar what is the shloka radhe ti naam parma sindhu aur krishna ti naam राधा नाम और कृष्ण नाम ज्वाइन दम टूगेदर मिक्स दम एंड ड्रिंक टू ड्रिंक द नेक्टर ऑफ प्लेस नाम माइंड ऑलवेज एंड ऑलवेज बी एब्सॉर्ब इन द नेम ऑफ श्री राधा एंड कृष्णा and drink the nectar of the Hare place Krishna Hare that's why it's chant Krishna Krishna Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 हम जो हरे कृष्ण कहते हैं मंत्र हरे कृष्ण राधे कृष्ण राधे कृष्ण राधे कृष्ण 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 राधे 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 श्याम राधे श्याम 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 राधे राधे हाउ ब्यूटिफुल दिस इज हरे कृष्ण सम संप्रदाय जैसे हरे मीन्स राधा ओरिजिनल नेम ऑफ राधा इज हरा हरा कृष्ण लाइक शी बिबिल हार्ट ऑफ कृष्ण हरा बिकॉज विद ब्यूटी एंड विद स्वीटनेस शी कम्प्लीटली It attracts the heart of Krishna. That's why her name is Hara. And in uh, the when you make it vocative, it becomes Hare. Like calling it down. Then Krishna means Krishna means attractive. All attractive. Hare Krishna. 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 Hare Krishna.
ये महामंत्र पहले किसने जपा फर्स्ट हु चांटे महामंत्र श्रीमती राधिका श्री इसके बाद किसने जपा कृष्ण स्थाति फ्रॉम वेयर दिस इज द ग्लोरीज ऑफ द होली नेम कृष्ण वॉज थिंकिंग वेयर दिस इज साउंड इज कमिंग फ्रॉम श्रीमती राधिका she was tasting the bliss of this uh, holy names and krishna said you have tasted this beautiful fruit and now i also want it rather than say okay now you chant also we both will chant together what did they chant together hari krishna 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 hari 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 ram hari ram ram कृष्ण किसके नाम जब कर रहे अपने नाम कृष्ण नेम्स ब्यूटीफुल मूल इज दिस दिस इज द महामंत्र ऑफ कल योग इज नो प्रॉब्लम इन चांडिंग एनी एन द मंत्र बट दिस इज कमिंग इन स्क्रिप्चर आई एम सींग इन स्क्रिप्चर बट द महामंत्र ऑफ कल योग द मोस्ट इफेक्टिव मंत्र इन दिस कल योग इज दिस वन राम राम हरे हरे चेतन महाप्रभु वेन ही वॉज वॉन्ड्रिंग थ्रू द साउथ ऑफ इंडिया मूड राम कृष्ण केशव कृष्ण केशव कृष्ण केशव राम 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 ecstatically mahaprabhu was singing krishna ke sava krishna ke sava krishna ke sava paahi man ram raghava ram raghava ram raghava rakshama krishna ke sava krishna ke sava krishna ke sava ram raghava ram raghava ram raghava कृष्ण केशव चांडिंग नेम ऑफ कृष्ण एंड चांडिंग नेम ऑफ केशव ऑल्सो राम एंड राघो कृष्ण केशव कृष्ण केशव कृष्ण के राम राम राघव राम राघव राम राघव राक्ष कृष्ण कृष्ण इज एड्रेसिंग कृष्ण वन इज ए केशव Like the one who decorates the hair of Shrimati Radhika. That's why her name, his name is Keshav. And Ram Raghav, Ramayatiti Ram, the one who is playing with Shrimati Radhika, meaning Raman Vihari. Mean like. What name is left? Raghav word is left. Raghav means Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He is, is he is he considering Ram Chandra in his Raghav? No, because many people think that Raghav is Ram, Ram Chandra. But here Raghav means. The word Raghav here means. Rag Dhatu, the element of rag. Where? So rag. Where there is ragahiti, like where the prema manifests, the word not raghav. It's mean rag. The rag means where two things meet, where two people meet. That is called rag. That is the element where two people meet and prema manifests. That is the meaning of the word raghav. That's why Mahaprabhu was singing this ecstatically. That's why Sri Krishna said, "Hey, Krishna, Hey 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 Krishna, राधे 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 
Live the way that Sham keeps you. The name of Shrimati Radhika is what? Shama. It's the name of Shrimati Radhika. Why, why is her name Shama? Shama means like blackish complexion. If you say Sham to Krishna because Krishna's complexion is a bit blackish, you can tell him Sham. But why Shama is the name of Shrimati Radhika? Because well, she is fair complexion. How possible this name is coming? From masculine to feminine, when you are, you can, you can say this, you can say Ram to Rama, okay, no problem, but in reality, well, Radhaji's one name is Shama, Shama name is why, why is it coming, I'll tell you this tomorrow, Jai. There is a very deep secret about this thing. It's 12.30, we'll do some fire sacrifice and then We'll offer the prasad to Thakurji and do some kirtan.